We're here at the World Telecommunication Development Conference 2014 in Dubai in the United Arab Emirates. And I'm very pleased to be joined by Mr. Nasser bin Hamad, who is Senior Manager for International Affairs for the Telecommunication Regulatory Authority of the UAE. Mr. bin Hamad, thank you very much indeed for being with us in the studio today. Thank you so much. I'd like to start off by talking about the venue here. We're here in the United Arab Emirates. Uh, it's been the venue here for a number of ITU events. I wanted to ask your take on this. Well, thank you so much, first of all. Uh, let me start by saying, following the successful hosting of the three major ITU events back in 2012 here in Dubai, and here in the premises of Dubai Water Center was a very successful story for the government of United Arab Emirates and very special to the Telecommunication Regulatory Authority. Following the successful of, of these mega events for the first time in the, in the Middle East and in Dubai uh, was giving us a very good experience actually. The government of United Arab Emirates therefore uh, and following that successful hosting uh, of, of these major events had decided back and had decided again to bring back again uh, the the one of the mega events of the of the of the development sector of the union that is the World Telecommunication Development Conference. So here we are. We have or we are all uh, uh, honored and pleased to have again the uh, the the one of the union conferences the World Telecommunication Development Conference 2014. WTDC is a, a major event on the ITU calendar. It's once every four years. I'm just wondering, in terms of your perspective, in terms of perspective of uh, the UAE, why is this conference important? Well, actually, this conference is considered to be the conference which looks after the uh, needs and requirements of the telecommunication uh, sector uh, in the world. ITU being a major uh, player uh, in this in this field uh, worldwide, I think the the, the conference is is really uh, a very opportunity, very good opportunity, basically, for those uh, involved uh, parties, uh, concerned bodies uh, worldwide, to come under one roof and discuss their needs very openly, very transparently, and join together in 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 drawing the path for the telecommunication sector for the coming four years. That's why I strongly believe that the World Telecommunication Development Conference of ITU is the conference which, looks, which is looking after uh, basically uh, these needs, these uh, uh, requirements of both the developing countries and the developed countries, as well as the least developing countries. Uh, through the discussions, negotiations, debates that goes all over the two weeks uh, a period of time uh, uh, discussing a variety of, of resolutions, discussing variety of, of recommendations, uh, issues uh, here and there, until uh, they, they, they come to a close uh, uh, a consensus between them and approving the, the resolutions which are going to uh, really uh, set the, the path for the, for the future. And very much also for the plenipotentiary conference happening uh, later on this year in Busan. Yes, that's right, because uh, the plenipotentiary conference which is going to take place in Busan by, by end of this year is, is going to set the, 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 the strategic plans and, and goals and objectives of the union, the entire union, uh, with, the, with the individual sectors for the, for the coming four years. And of course, in this year, we have the World Telecommunication Development Conference, which is going to give its output and, 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 and results that is going to be resulted from here into the agenda of the, of the Plenipotentiary Conference. So I believe the, the entire world is, is just waiting for the Plenipotentiary Conference to come in Poussin in this year so that they, they, they participate all together in defining uh, the goals, objectives and the plans for the entire union. The theme here is broadband for sustainable development. I know UAE is making great strides in terms of broadband connectivity. What are the outcomes that you hope will come from this conference? Well, I believe, uh, talking from the perspective of the, of, the, of the government of United Arab Emirates and, and more especially the Telecommunication Regulatory Authority, uh, we, 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 do, we don't have an individual agenda in this conference. The agenda is, 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 is basically a regional agenda. That's why you see there is uh, the Arab Regional uh, Proprietary Group, uh, which has took the role to uh, uh, look after the, 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 the agenda and the theme of the, of the conference. That's why you see many resolutions uh, have been set, have been defined, have been uh, drafted by the Arab group 
and 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 basically discussed here in the in the in the uh, in the conference. Uh, moreover, moreover, uh, there are a set of uh, initiatives uh, being presented and and proposed by the Arab Regional uh, Preparatory Group itself. And one of the one of those uh, one of those uh, initiatives is basically talking about the about the broadband uh, connectivity. And this came actually from the uh, the uh, the strong need and strong uh, requirement of the Arab region uh, itself to look after this this part of of the broadband connectivity. Not all Arab uh, administrations today having uh, equal uh, uh, equal. Uh, uh, sizes of of the of the broadband connectivity. It's it varies between between the Arab countries themselves. That's why we really need to to see by the efforts and and help and assistance of the BDT and the experts in the BDT in the next uh, agenda of the four years, uh, the four coming years uh, after the conference, to really engage together the private sector and the government sector to engage in, in shaping the, the future of, of such, uh, of such uh, broadband connectivities. Nasser bin Hamad, thank you very much indeed for being with us today. Thank you so much for this opportunity. Thank you. And thank you for watching too.